the Plaza Four in Century City for this week only. So if you go next week, it's too late. She'll be at the Frontier in Las Vegas starting December the 22nd at the Hyatt Regency in Dearborn, Michigan starting January the 5th. Would you welcome Miss Joan Rivers? Beautifully. Oh, she does. I hope she's not happy. What? It just kills me. Do you have a calendar like this out? Not, huh? uh, well, I tried, but unfortunately, just one month. <laughs> they, they said, forget that the rest yeah, of the year, said, huh? Bleh. That's no. too <laughs> They saw December and says, well, forget it. No, I have no sex appeal. I, you know that. I'm just eating. No, I, see, I, oh, no, no, come on. You're going to start that self deprecating stuff. Well, how again. can you and Anna sitting next to you? You know what I'm telling you? How can you? I mean, uh, my marriage, I mean, there's nothing, there's no romance left. Oh, come Last on. Last time there was any sexual, you know, yeah. he was doing push ups and I slid in. And otherwise, <laughs> Yes, cruel. Yeah, that's a, but I've got other things. I don't know well, what. Of course you have. Yeah, no. tell me. You do that all the time. I no, thought, don't, don't you find you really get up and look in the mirror and say, gee, oh, come on. Oh, does, Johnny. Does it bother can... you? Do you get along? Uh, that you're getting, we're all getting older. Oh, not me if I was smart. Are you kidding? No. I think that's where Betty Ford was very smart. Just pull it up and snip it off and throw it away if you don't like it. That's it. <laughs> Well, I, you know how I admire her? She came out in public, one of the first ladies, and admitted she wanted to look better, where most people, yeah. you know, went in a closet and said, oh, no, I've never had anything done. I've yeah. never had it. And they're talking to the part in their hair. That's right. Italian, you're not... Speaking to my nose. Yeah. Right. <laughs> Have they you... Uh... their legs up here. Now, we... yeah. <laughs> now, we've known each other for a long time, so I'm going to, I'm going to ask you straight out in front yeah. of the entire nation. Yeah. And let's see how honest you are. Have <laughs> you ever had anything... Done? Yes. Anything that I could, no, I, uh, <laughs> no, I would like to have everything done. Yes. But uh, my father's a doctor, you know, and I always hear these terrible stories That's about. Right. You grew up in all that. I grew up stuff. in that whole milieu, but I grew up when doctors were still good. They're advertising now. I mean, it's at the, the pits. I mean, I'm so nervous. You know, the ad, wherever you look, there's gonna be an ad. I was the gynecologist this afternoon. And all I kept thinking is, what if there's a hidden camera? I was so nervous. <laughs> Miss Rivers. <laughs> 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 just awful. That would be kind of shabby, I think, taking it that far, but... Derwin Kirby would jump out, you Yes. Know? <laughs> Are you ready for the pap test challenge? <laughs> The, the gynecologist, because women, she's, wait, I see, I never get in the stirrups, you know what, because I, I no, no, because you're a fool to get in the stirrups if you're a woman, sit way back and hope the doctor will come in without his glasses, look under your arm and go through it. <laughs> never get in the stirrups. Did, uh, did you ever get the feeling he's going to go, go boy, come on. Well, that can't be a pleasant experience, no. I suppose. No, that's, that's... That, an hour before you show up, the doctor puts his hand in the refrigerator. I mean, oh, there's that's so got, many... Oh, that's... <laughs> got to make your little hair twirl out, yeah. See, because well, that's Beverly Hills. Yeah. You know, they all laugh. They, my guy has Gucci stirrups. I mean, it's all just... Be Hills, Be Hills. You, Beverly Hills is a very... You find them a little too impersonal and oh, it's laid a, back? You mean? It's a sick community. I fit in, thank goodness. I mean, it's right. shallow. You know, it's wonderful. You don't have to read a book. You, know, you have yeah. to know one word, Perrier. That's Perrier. That's very big, yeah. Perrier, Perrier. You go to the laundromat, <laughs> 12 cents extra, you can wash your clothes in Perrier. <laughs> I mean, it's just... <laughs> Perrier, Perrier. God, that's a little My strange. gardener yesterday, I said, would you like a glass of water, Manuel? He goes, yes, Perrier. Vivier. He knows three words. Yes, Perrier and immigration. That's the only word he knows. <laughs> Did you ever think you see a country getting rich from selling water? Water. Selling water. Isn't and that because they're, they're supposed to be so cool. You know, there's the Evian and then there's Perrier and all this. And everybody thinks that if you drink regular water now, you're going to die or something. I don't My understand that. My dentist rinses in Perrier now. Well, that's class. <laughs> you spit it out. Little they, bubbles. They rebottle it. And get it <laughs> <laughs> Life ain't easy, is it? Oh, though? I have a dentist uh, the lowest. Next to the spit sink, he has a fan. I mean, just... <laughs> you go in and you go... <laughs> what is it? <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Oh, God. 
God, and he married rich, you know. They all married. See, that's what this whole town is about. Yeah, money. You and I didn't do this. We married, and you too, we married for love, you know. We should have married rich oldies. Really? Until, oh, sure. Oh. Get a person with a pacemaker, go, I'm glad I'm married! <laughs> <laughs> and you're on the Ilda France saying, busboy, another drinker. Oh, sure. yeah, oh, you're hot tonight. Oh, no. It's... We'll be right back. Stay with us. <laughs> this is getting crazy. In this Talking with Anne Margaret, Joan Rivers. Your doctor's going to be mad at you now that you've uh, oh. publicly exposed them for what they are. Well, you know, as I said, my father's a doctor. I've been brought up in medical circles. He still practices, right? Oh yes, but you know, we don't dare to advertise because they'll finally catch him. Because he never had a <laughs> Oh, that's right. Since the uh, two job. years in medical school, two years in tier one. That's you remember. right. I remember. And, um, <laughs> but uh, <laughs> he only worked on dead people. That way, nothing could happen. You know, he's a. No, that's it. But uh, I know, I'm, I, I, a lot of medical people obviously are terrific. Yeah. The ones I really resent more and more, though, are nurses. Nurses are... You've are, never gotten along well with nurses, No. They, no. Because they, they're very sexy individuals, and they're really not interested in me. You know, while I was having Melissa, a nurse, a nurse short sheet in my bed, and that got me crazy. <laughs> that and another nurse who had a practical joker streak in her. Yes. When I had the kid, she brought out a puppy in a blanket. Oh, and that's just, you know... <laughs> <laughs> that's fun in the hospital. You're thinking, which sale was that? I mean, it's just... <laughs> Wouldn't that be funny? You had cheated once, and then you get a puppy, and you go, oh. You know. <laughs> gotta bring it home. Are you, are you going to have more children, or have you I, just phased it out now? I, but I, if I have a child, I'm going to have it. I, as a special. What do you mean a special? Because everybody, see, when I had Melissa, they yes. had them in private. Now I have friends, they have babies, they have natural childbirth, the and Lamas, they take yeah. movies. Yeah. I had a friend took movies of a childbirth. Pat birth. Boone was in here Pat, talking about... Oh, blech, you know what I'm telling you? And then they go to your house for dinner, and they bring the movies with them, and you had to... <laughs> am I right? I went to... Here comes the kid, have an hors d'oeuvre. I said, I don't want to see that. <laughs> yeah. Run that film back and let's see the kid disappear. <laughs> Get back in there. I want to see. And the mother walking out. <laughs> you're crazed tonight. You're slightly yeah, crazed. Because I haven't seen you in You're so all long. young, energy. Someone yeah. told me you're doing. I never knew that you. Are you doing political stuff? I mean, are you oh, yes. involved in causes or are you just political oh, dinners causes, or what? Yeah. Causes and politics, you know. It's just, um, um, this country is the best country in the world. I should preface, right. Johnny. I mean, there's no, I wouldn't live anyplace else except maybe Iran and get all that money out quick. And then, you know, <laughs> and, uh, and, um, but it, this kind of, I mean, the inflation is driving me crazy. I'm really yeah. getting very active now. I mean, yeah. the cost of meat is incredible. Hi, eh? Uh, the cost of meat? <laughs> I heard. <laughs> I heard Sherry Lewis ate her ass. <laughs> 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 sad, sad. Yes. So I'm very involved. That and, of course, ERA, you know, because yeah. women have never been given... See, we don't think about ERA because we're... No. We've always worked, right? Ann Margaret's worked, I've worked. But there are a lot of women, and uh, they, they give us, like, half a loaf, you know what I'm talking about? Like, um, they made it the rape prevention center, yeah. right? It was supposed to be terrific. A guy's going to molest you, call them up. But they don't give you the address, so that doesn't help any woman, you know what I'm talking about? <laughs> or the phone number. I mean, by the time you call information and you get the number and you call them, the guy is lying next to you smoking a cigarette. I said, what is this? Was it good for you? I mean, <laughs> so I'm into these courses and, yeah. and I think it's important. A mother should be, you know? Oh, yes. And also Egg is English, so he doesn't get that involved. Just a little bit now. You yeah. know, yeah, because he's his sister got ma married. And your sister got married to an English prince. Isn't that interesting? Yes. First Jewish prince. Yeah, I'm very impressed. <laughs> yeah, you've heard a lot of Jewish princes. Certainly. This is the first. His mother. They're not real princes. Ah. You know, his mother had slept with Prince Philip, and this That's is close. the That's, That's close. close. You know, and um, they're gonna move into Abramowitz Hall, which I think is very elegant. Abramowitz Hall. Abramowitz Hall in England with the Abramowitz ghost, and uh, a. <laughs> <laughs> It's a Jewish ghost. Yeah. Walks by night, it walks by day. <laughs> Sometimes it doesn't Sometimes walk. Sometimes it doesn't walk. If it's tired, it don't walk. If it's cold, it walks in Miami. I mean, it just... <laughs> it walks when it wants to. <laughs>
<laughs> oh, you're funny tonight. Oh. <laughs> Just good to see you. Okay, Will. You're crazed tonight. Ooh, up here. We'll do this. Lou Holtz is with us, and we have a lingerie fashion show. Sure. Trampy models. Trampy models. Yes. All legs. Legs up to here. Legs. All legs. Legs yes. up to here. We'll be right back. All legs. No body. All legs.